Would you like to be more organized? Most of us would. It saves time, it helps you achieve your goals, and it leads to higher productivity. One way you can do this is keep a notebook or use an app like Evernote. This can act as a catch-all for your thoughts, notes, and to-do lists so they're all in one place. If you do choose to use paper, you'll write down a lot of important information in this notebook over time. So make sure you don't lose it. Next, use the first 15 minutes of your day to organize yourself. Make a to-do list and prioritize what you have to get done. This means that you don't forget what you've promised to do and means that you do the most important things first. After this, take a few minutes to tidy your desk. Although some people can work in a messy workspace, it's distracting for most of us. File away papers you're not using, recycle anything you're done with, and put away your office supplies in your drawer. If your desk is really cluttered, then wait to do this at the end of the day. Or you could work on getting your desk organized bit by bit every day until it's done. If you find yourself struggling to stay organized, then promise yourself a reward. For instance, if you finish four things on your to-do list, then get a cup of coffee or take a walk outside. You should also use just one calendar for all your appointments and meetings. It's easy to miss something important when your schedule is written down in several different places. Last, choose organizing tools that you really like. You're more likely to use a notebook or planner if it's visually appealing. Disorganization can lower your productivity, cause stress, and limit your career opportunities. See the article that accompanies this video for more tips and strategies to help you save time and get organized.